Hi guys, Dave and David here from payitforward.com and upphone.com and in this video we're going to tell you about six Apple Watch settings you should change immediately, three to turn on, three to turn off. David Lynch is an Apple Watch expert so he's going to walk us through the process step by step. Yeah, and everything we're going to do is on your iPhone in the watch app and the settings app so make sure you have that handy. Our first tip is to turn on Emergency SOS. Emergency SOS lets you call for help in any number of countries throughout the world. It doesn't just work in the US, it works all over the place. Mm -hmm. Let's show them how to turn yep. it on. So we'll open the watch app. Scroll down to Emergency SOS and just turn on this switch next to hold side button. Now when you press and hold the side button, it'll trigger Emergency SOS and emergency services will be called. That's awesome, especially yep. if you're not near your phone and you need to get help. Yep. Just hold the side button. So our next tip is to turn on enable screenshots. By default, you can't actually take screenshots on your Apple Watch. You have to turn on a switch mm -hmm. to do that. Maybe you just did a workout, you ran 26 miles in two hours and you want to show your friends well. I take a screenshot to. of the Apple Watch screen of the workout app and you can show them. Let's do it. So we'll go back to the main page of the watch app, scroll up to general, scroll down here to enable screenshots. Now it's on. So now if I press and hold the digital crown and the side button at the same time on my Apple Watch, take a screenshot and that'll always show up in the photos app on your iPhone. There it is. That's cool. It shows up right away too. It's yeah, amazing it's, how quick. It's very fast. Mm -hmm. So the third setting to turn on on your Apple Watch is the irregular heart rate rhythm notifications. Mm -hmm. What a cool feature this is. Mm -hmm. can save your life. Let's <laughs> turn it on. Yeah. yeah. So I'll go back to the watch app, back to the main page of the watch app, and tap on heart. And here you see set up irregular rhythm notifications in health. Tap on that, take it to the health app, Set up notifications. Apple Watch can look for atrial fibrillation. So then you just work through these prompts, fill out some basic information about your date of birth, uh, whether you've had heart issues in the past, mm -hmm. and then you can actually set up like, here's the maximum heart rate and here's the minimum heart rate. And if I go out of these areas, mm -hmm. uh, something might be wrong. And then you'll get a notification on your Apple Watch saying, hey, something might be wrong with your heart. You might want to call 911. <laughs> yeah. And then you can use emergency SOS to do so because yeah. we just turn that on. Right. And if it's not already wrong with your heart, that'll put you right over the edge because yeah. that would freak me out. So now let's talk about settings to turn off. The first one is watch analytics. And you actually do this in the settings app of your iPhone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, analytics are little pieces of data that Apple uses to improve their products and services. Also third party app developers can use them. It's their job to improve their products. This will save you some data and a little bit of battery life too. Yep. So we'll open up the settings app on our iPhone, scroll down to privacy, down to analytics, and turn off this switch next to share iPhone and watch analytics. So also turn off data collection on your Apple Watch. That's exactly what we wanted to do. Exactly. While you're here, you'll probably just want to turn off share iCloud analytics. This is nothing to do with your Apple Watch, but a little bonus tip. A little for bonus you. tip for you. Save a little battery life yeah. and data. Perfect. Yeah, so our next tip is to turn off unnecessary background app refresh. And this is especially important if your Apple Watch has GPS plus cellular mm -hmm. because the background app refresh can actually use some cellular data and sure. you don't want to do that. Yeah, these are apps that you give permission to download content in the background of your watch when you're not using them. So let's go back to the watch app, scroll down and tap general, and then tap background app refresh. Now go through this list see which ones you don't want, need background app refresh for. We don't recommend turning it off entirely because you probably want to keep it for some apps. But for me, for example, I don't need it for the Apple Store app. Right, and for me, I turn off almost every app in this list to save battery life and to save data. Mm -hmm. But I leave just a few on that I want to always be up to date. So mm -hmm. our final tip is to turn off workout power saving mode. Yes, this will save you some battery life, but it also disables the heart rate sensor on your Apple Watch, which can really throw off your calorie calculations if you're trying to count calories or something. And it mm -hmm. kind of defeats the purpose of having a very detailed workout app. Right. This is only good if you're running out of battery every day, which I'm personally not. Yeah. Especially mm -hmm. in the Apple Watch. The Apple Watch battery is really good and mm -hmm. don't really need to worry about it. But if you do have Apple Watch battery issues, check out our article in the card above in the description section below to turn off workout power saving mode. Go back to general and scroll down to workout power saving mode. As you can see, I have that turned on. Tap the switch, turn it off. Now it's off. Mm -hmm. It's a great idea just to keep that off because you're going to get the most out of your Apple Watch by yeah. having that switch off. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Those are six Apple Watch settings you need to change immediately. Thank you for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed. Leave us a comment down below if you have any tips for us. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more great Apple videos.